talking about the Greater Cincinnati STEM Collaborative's Mission Space Lander project. We're going to try to build a spacecraft that could fall from space and land on a planet, in this case maybe Mars, safely. And our marshmallows are acting as our aliens that we're trying to keep safe, that are falling towards a strange planet um, from space. And our craft is going to be what keeps them safe once they fall down. The Greater Cincinnati STEM Collaborative gave some basic tools for us to start with. Those were straws, paper, index cards, Dixie cups, marshmallows, or our aliens, and those were the tools. I also found it helpful to have some tape. I would consider having a yardstick as well um, because our spacecraft is going to be falling from two feet up from our planet. So from our table all the way up to about two feet. So then we can know what distance we're falling from. And then I also like to have a marsh, a marker so that I could draw face on my marshmallow and make it into a Martian mellow or a space Martian. How do you absorb the impact of your fall for your Martians? So let's say we use our Dixie cup as the basis for our craft because it's what's going to kind of hold our marshmallows. If something falls from high above and it lands down onto a hard surface, it's going to be quite a shock, right? And to keep it safe, we want to have something a little bit softer than just landing on the flat surface. So, what are some ways that you could use the materials that you have to kind of cushion your marshmallow Martians fall? And then also, how would weight distribution play a part in the design? So when we're building our craft and it's going to be falling from above, if we have something softer below our craft, do we want it to have weight distributed all over below the craft? Do we want to have it more weight on one side or more weight on another side? Um, those are some things to think about while building your craft. Also, um, if you are looking for a starting place, a good place to start might be the actual spacecraft that was built um, to land on a strange surface. So I would look up the Mars rover and see what it looks like if you're just looking for a starting place. I am excited to see what kind of awesome spacecrafts you build to keep your Martians safe. So I wanted to share with you guys um, my Martian mellows. Uh, I just kind of gave them like crazy eyes and squiggly mouths and I wanted to share my spacecraft with you. So I measured on my yardstick up to two feet and so let's see if my Martians survive the fall. <laughs> Here we go. Three. Two, one. All 
great. Good luck, guys. For more STEM cards, visit the Greater Cincinnati STEM Collaborative.